A lot about the benefits of buying and eating fruits and vegetables that are grown close to home. But in Chicago, finding local grown produce is often a challenge, especially. Some young entrepreneurs, though, on the South Side are trying aquaphonics to change that. WGN's Dan Ponce on what could revolutionize urban farming. Locally grown exotic basils and beautiful leaves of lettuce are pretty hard to come by during Chicago's brutal winter months. But this December, they are thriving in an indoor garden in what was once a useless abandoned meatpacking warehouse in Chicago's back of the yards neighborhood. The company is called 312 Aquaphonics, an indoor ecosystem designed to grow delicious produce quickly. With indoor growing, um, you can bring a whole new uh, spectrum of, of products to Chicago or to the Midwest or an urban setting. Andrew Furnitz, 24 years old, started the company with three friends right after graduating from UIC. In showing us how the system works, he started here. Huge tanks home to hundreds of tilapia, hardy and fast growing. The waste generated by the fish is converted into fertilizer for the plants. And when the fish are full grown, they'll head to the fish market. This is kind of like the heart of the system. This is where all the water comes and accumulates from all its different um, areas. Also contributing, a rock bed full of hundreds of worms. The worms help mineralize and break down the fish waste. When you're seeing worms, you know you have a healthy garden. The water, packed with nutrients, is monitored 24 hours a day with digital sensors and corresponding software. The water circulates under big styrofoam trays where the plants grow under special fluorescent lights. As long as you have healthy, oxygenated, um, well-cycled water, they're going to stay um, healthy and they're not going to get root rot and they're going to grab um, nutrients quicker than they actually would out of the soil. And instead of pesticides, ladybugs do the work. They live freely throughout the indoor garden. Some plants only take 21 days to go from seedling to harvest. A three-level system allows for a harvest every five to seven days. Among their customers, executive chef Guy Michael of the popular organic restaurant Nana in Bridgeport. It's kind of unique to have a, a local product with that much variation. Usually you get basil or Italian basil or Thai basil, but to have you know cinnamon basil and sweet basil and you know tons of different things coming in as well.